Hi crew, welcome to another episode of the Captain Calamity Adventures here at the Lollipop Lighthouse in Chocolate Button Bay and I'm going to teach you how to make this ace balloon reindeer and this super cool snowman. Keep watching. Captain Calamity, Captain Calamity, Captain Calamity, fun for you and fun for you and fun for you and me and me. So let's start with the snowman. It's really easy and I'm going to teach you how. So we'll put the reindeer out of the way for now. We'll get it in a minute. Let's put it here next to my other reindeer. Keep watching. Okay. So, how do we make the snowman? Well, you need two white round balloons. Now, I have got one which has got a, a snowman print on it. But if you don't have a snowman print one, these are great. These are Sharpie pens. They're indelible markers. They will write and draw on the face of the balloon so that you can get the look that you want. So, let's get started. We need that round and that, oh, let's use these two. Here we go. Snowman face, snowman body. Very simply, tie the nibs together. There we go. Look at that. Brilliant. You could leave it at that if you wanted, but I like to make a scarf for the snowman as well. I've chosen a red color for the scarf, and we were using these thick, oh, hello, reindeer. He wants to be in on the action. You sit there for me and watch this. Okay, happy, good, right, so, red. Now, this one is not a 260, like the big thick ones we've used before. This is actually a 160, which means it's slightly thinner. And I think that works really well with the snowman. But I'm fussy, you don't need to be. What do we do now? Simple, you just wrap it around. Give him a scarf, right round, don't be shy, and then twist it at the back. You can, if you want, do what we've done before, which is that pinch twist, where you twist a little bit of the balloon, create a bubble, and twist it in. But it really isn't entirely necessary. And there we are. If you want, you can make the air come up at the ends so that that flicks up and it looks like you're catching it in the wind. And then all you need to do is the dots on the bottom for the, um, for the buttons made out of coal. You can use black or if you prefer, I like red dots. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. I think that's enough. And I think that snowman looks super, don't you? So there's our snowmen. They look great together, don't they? A great decoration for Christmas time. But now, let's make our reindeer. And that's really easy too, and I'll show you how. What you need for, our, for your reindeer is this. This is what we're gonna end up with. Okay. It looks complicated, but I can tell you, it really is easy. This is what you're gonna do. Take your balloon, take about maybe six, seven fingers, and then twist. And then here, twist, twist, and twist. So we're just making some legs. They're about four fingers long, okay? And then again, you wanna do, give it a bit of a back, and then create those legs again. Here, here, and here. There we go. Couldn't be simpler. You're going for the, that look. It doesn't look like much at the moment, but it will do. Now, you can either leave the tail like that, but reindeer have very little tails, so let's just take that down a bit. I just bit it, you don't have to bite it. You can use scissors if you prefer, or as I suggest, just leave it. What I like to do is just push that through there, that's the back legs, grab that, and just twist that into the knot at the back, the join of the back legs, there we go. And I think that gives us a more convincing reindeer tail, but I'm just being fussy. So we've got that. What next? This balloon. What do we want to do? Well, you want to get about half, so do a little twist there so you know you've got half, okay? This color is sort of a 
I suppose it's a mocha type color, but again, it really doesn't matter. They're your reindeer. They can look like however you like. And we wanna get a bow in the balloon. So this is what we're gonna do. Just like that, and a bow. And we know that's about middle. And then we need a little gap, and then a bow. And it really doesn't need to be exact, because you know what reindeer's horns are like, they're always different and different lengths, so it can be. And then just want that twist in the middle. Those are different lengths, but I really don't think it matters. I think it adds to it. Now that's the front of your first balloon creation. And you just want to feed, about halfway, you want to feed that in there and twist it round. We're getting that lovely reindeer look now. That will do. Again, we're there. But I add a few details. What am I going to add? Well, it is Christmas time and this is Rudolph. So I'm going to add a nose. That's my red nose. How did I make that? It, all I did was I blew up a 260, which is one of these balloons, one of the thicker ones. And I only wanted the end of it, so I, waited, I, I deflated it, but I held on to the end, so I got that bubble at the end, tied that off, cut it, and now, as long as you've got a little bit of a tail, you can tie that in. And there we go. Tie that into the nib. A little bit tricky, but worth persevering with. And again, don't worry if you pop it. Balloons are great. You can just make new ones if you pop it. I like to do a double knot just to secure it, but really a single knot will do as well. Here we go, being fiddly there. Okay, so that's a double knot. That looks pretty good, right? One more thing. Just take all that, all the scrap, and just push that into your balloon, just a little way. Don't worry, if it pops, it's just doing a little twist. And all that does, two things. One, it gives the reindeer a little bit of a face, just down here. It also flips the nose up a bit, and it keeps it nice and secure, and it hides the scrap. And there it is, a reindeer. And again, if you want to, take your pen, and you can do a face. Well, that does happen. But that's how you do it, folks. So give it a go. There we are, our reindeer balloon and our, where's our other one? Oh, our snowman balloon, if I can find him. There he is, brilliant. You can make these, enjoy it, have lots of fun. Don't forget to check out the other Christmas balloon video because that's also lots of fun. There's going to be a message coming up, so do check it out. It's from one of our friends at the Lollipop Lighthouse, so I hope you enjoy it. Don't forget to drop, drop a comment in the comment section below. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. But above all, be safe, be smart, be smiley, and enjoy the messages. Hi, Captain Calamity. It's Gary Schiffman. Um, just here with my main man, James Bond himself, Daniel Craig. Um, he's feeling a bit shy today, doesn't want to say too much. But I just wanted to wish you a very Merry Christmas and thank you for having me on the show this year. And hope to have, come back to the Lighthouse next year. See you soon. Bye.